times I had to go through the warm-up routine. The twists and turns of that women's singles, they may have thought that it would all be over in two straight games, had to keep themselves warm and agile through the whole of that hour and 11 minutes of the women's singles final. But their moment is here because it is the last final of the day. Uh, Pratama and Suwadi, the new Indonesian pair up against Fu Haifeng and Shang Nan of China. The beaten All England finalists, the Chinese pair. And they really, both of them have a huge amount of experience as individuals, but as a pair, more experience, obviously, than Pratama and Suwadi. of the OUE Singapore Open 2015 men's doubles. From Indonesia, world ranking number 41, Anga Pratama and Ricky Karanda Suwade. Anga Pratama and Ricky Karanda Suwade. New Indonesian pair. Finalists at the 2014 oh, and even reached a semi final of the Super Series event prior to this tournament in Singapore. And going against them are world ranking number 11 from China, Fu Haifeng and Chang Nan. The left handed Fu Haifeng, twice a champion here with his former partner, Tai Yun now playing with Jang Nan. Sets in the men's doubles draw on the way through to today's final. And the big talking points at quarter final stage was the loss of the number one and two seeds. The World Championship silver medalists, uh, Lee Yong Gay and Yu Yang Sung, uh, losing out to Pratama and Suwadi. And Li Sheng Mu and Sai Chia Sin uh, losing out to Fu and Zhang. So the two pairs that beat the number one and two seeds through to the final, and that seems fitting. Well, as far as the destination Dubai list is concerned, I can tell you that Endo and Hawakawa, beaten semi-finalists yesterday, will go up to number one. And uh, of course, with Asun and Setia One also doing well here, semi-finalists, uh, they will go up two places to number four. So the top Danes, well, they'll be knocked off those top spots. So the Indonesian pair, Anga Pratama, will turn 24 next month, born in Jakarta. And of course, he had a very successful partnership with Saputro. Uh, Ricky Karanda Suwadi, 23 years of age from Sirabon in West Java. 41 on the world ranking is not realistic. They've only got seven tournaments towards that world ranking. In fact, they went up 13 places after reaching the quarterfinal of the Malaysian Super Series last week. Now, on their path through to today's final, that quarterfinal win over the world number ones, Lee Yong Day and Yu Young Sung, is the only match that they won in two straight games. That's an extraordinary statistic. Semi final yesterday against the number three seeds, Endo and Hawakawa, who, as I say, will go up to number one on the destination Dubai ranking after this event in Singapore. So, to the Chinese combination and Fu Haifeng, the veteran at the age of 31 from Zhejiang in China, in Guangdong province. His partner, 
Chang Nam. Well, he should have played the mixed doubles final first, but of course he and Zhao Yun Lei were given a walkover. He's 25 years of age from Beijing. They're the number five seeds, 11 in the world ranking at the moment, although they have been as high as eight. And their quarterfinal knocked out the number two seeds, Li and Sai. And in the semi-final yesterday, beat the 2013 winners of the Singapore Open, Mohamed Hassan and Hendra Setiawan. So Fabio Beto of Italy, our umpire, and Satiawan Mahadu from Mauritius, our service judge. China. On my left, Anga Pratama, Ricky Caranda Suarte, Indonesia. Yeah. Anga Pratama, to serve to Fu Hai Feng, Lobo, Flag. meeting between these two pairs, quite understandable, seeing as Pratama One. and Suwadi no. they formed their partnership at the very last Super Series event last year, that was the Hong Kong Open. 28 shots for an opening rally, that's not bad is it? Hey. Oh, it's landing in, yeah, decided to take a late decision. One, all. An incredible defence and the way that Jiang Nang just walked into that smash and played it from the front court area. Fun winner of this title with Taiwan in 2007 and 2011. Yeah. Oh, that's a great shot from Pratama. Three, one. Quite a contrast in the number of tournaments these two players pairs have over, been in two, so far this year. Three. The Indonesians, this is their sixth tournament of the year. Fu Haifeng and Zhang Nang, only two previous tournaments, but of course they did reach the final of the All England Championships. Lost out to Bo and Morganson of Denmark in the final. Over, four, two. Well, whichever pair wins today's final, we're guaranteed a fourth different pair winning the men's doubles title at the fourth Super Series event of the year. Well, that's a pretty healthy situation, isn't it, for Royal Badminton?
Ooh, miss it. Yeah, came off the frame of the racket. Seven. Ooh, high fun. Three. Completely mistiming it. This one. Yeah, came off the frame. Simple put away for the Indonesians. Suwadi. Top spin in a little mid court shot. Good return of serve. Yeah, there's another top spin defensive shot. getting in each other's way. Yeah, that's over. the problem with a new Four. partnership. You don't have that complete Eight. understanding who's going for what. It's interesting that the two, Ind two Indonesian players played against each other in this tournament last year. Danny Cantono, the Indonesian Nine, coach. Nine, four. Remarkable reaction on the defence from Chang Nan. Well, doesn't show a lot of emotion. Bounced off the top of the tape. A little bit of luck for Suwadi, but in all honesty, he created his own luck. If it hadn't bounced off the net, it would have been an outright winner anyway, I suspect. Four receiver, 11 4. Oh, fault injured. receiver moving before the serve was struck. And it means that Pratama and Suwadi. Have a seven point advantage at the mid game interval of game number one. And it's all happening in double quick time, just six minutes. Oh, Ooh, I don't know about that. Well, umpire in the best position to see, better position than me. And the Chinese coaches, Tian Bingyi, in the blue tracksuit top. And Chang Nan. Oh, sorry, Chang Nan. Chang Jun. Eleven four. Line. Oh, good flick serve. Well, four. Too, but it was the little cross court Third, push from four. Anga Pratama that forced the error. I can't believe this scoreline. I would never have predicted this. A 10 point advantage for the young Indonesians. Yeah, although initially it was a good backhand. 
from Pratama. And he followed it up with the smash. There's the backhand. Super shot. There, Suwadi. Oh, this is absolutely extraordinary. I wouldn't have predicted this in a month of Sundays. Chinese pair desperately need to play themselves in before the start of this second game. I think game number one is probably beyond them. Section in Jiangnan. Let's push long. Oh, it's cool, good. Yeah, don't waste a challenge, you're so far in front. 11, 19. Shot there from Jang Nan. I really wish he would have the opportunity in the mixed doubles to get his eye in. Because there's a whole yeah. host of game point opportunities here for the Indonesians. Service over. 
coming on. 14, 20. It's gone okay. long. So 21 15 in the end. First game won by Yanga Pratama, Enrique Caranda Suarte, 21 15. Yeah, casually lets it go long. Sixteen minutes for that opening game. Twenty-one fifteen. Both these players so experienced, they're both reigning Olympic champions at the moment. Bill Hai Fung in the men's doubles, Joan Nan in the mixed doubles. 64 titles between them, 40 of them Super Series titles. But of course, as far as Joan Nan is concerned, 24. Now that he was given a walkover in the first of our finals today, 24 in the mixed doubles with Chow Yun Lei. 20 seconds. This Chinese pair have won a Super Series title. That was the Denmark Open last year. Final of the All England, the first of the Super Series events this year. So vastly more experience Second than. Day. Their Indonesian opponents. Level. Can they use that experience to turn this final Flight. around? Suwadi finding an angle. A bit of belief, really. Look at this coming up. This one here. That's phenomenal. It's gone long. as high as number seven in the world ranking with Arian Adan Saputro. The Chinese 
Spear in all sorts of trouble. Yeah, well, they're both leaving it for each other. They got out of position, got themselves in a total muddle early on in that rally, and then both left it for the other when the shot down the centre of the court. Look, they're way out of position. Oh, that's extraordinary. doesn't want to change the shuttle. Four times world champion as well as his Olympic title with uh, Yun. It's gone long as well. Five, yeah, there's a big difference three. in ends. sense a change in momentum. Six, three. Perhaps we shouldn't forget that Jiang Nan has also won a Super Series event in the men's doubles with China Biao, China Masters of 2012. He's run off to change his racket. My goodness me. His partner even knew about it. And he seemed so casual at the time. Well, oh, just take a look at this. Yeah, racket's gone. I'll go and get another one. Partner, just hold the fort while I'm gone. Oh, how on earth didn't the Indonesians capitalize on Seven. that? Five. Yeah. 
the channel attack. from Jiang Nan. Sarah there from Fuhai Tan. Seven, nine. First one of the match. to the mid-game interval. And his combination with a three-point advantage. No, much more on the pace, much more aggressive. Just blasted away in that opening game. The score line of 21 15 just does not give the whole story. Seconds. 20 seconds. Judgment, my goodness me, I thought that might come back in. 
15, 12. the nine judge indicated in and then changed his mind and out. said it out and I think that indecision has sparked the Indonesian pair into challenging first challenge of this men's doubles final why we have Hawkeye. How can you tell from that? That's desperately close. Oh, the instant review system. Still deliberating. Yeah, it was close, I know that. Challenge unsuccessful. Service over. 13, 10. Wadi Pratama have one challenge remaining. Play. Peculiar. 14, 10. Oh, nine judges' decision. Rally. I don't think it's the best rally, but it's certainly the longest. Persistent, pays off in the end. Yeah, foo high fun. My goodness, he felt that. The 31 year olds. Nine shots, my goodness me, clearly the longest rally. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Sixteen. Deciding game. Oh, I'm sure the fans here would love it. Two 
points away from the second game. 19, So only won one more point since that Hawkeye decision on the serve. So game point opportunities. Ten of them to be precise to level this final at one game apiece. Went for that. Service over 11 20. Put each other off. Yeah. Yep, one game all 21 11, that second game. Good repost by the Second game won by Kuhai Feng and Jiangnan, 21-11, one game, all. 27 minutes into the match. 37 minutes. saying to his men something I think about front court player being more active getting involved more dominate that net area Oh, that's just a glorious shot from Pratama. Guiding the shuttle from the nets into the mid-court area, down towards the tram line. Oh, you really don't see better than that. That's perfect. Oh, it's wide. Well, there's a challenge here. Challenge pulled out. From the Chinese pair. Well, I don't there make a prediction because I got the last one wrong. It was the sideline in question. Yeah, that's out, surely. No, we're not at the best angle to see that, but it does look wide, doesn't it? Yep, Hawkeye confirms it as out. Challenge, challenge unsuccessful. Two love. Full junk have one challenge remaining. Black. Oh, miss it, I miss it. Three love.
Sangha. Rally. Oh, super interception from Jang Nan. Service so over. One, three. decision to play it. Oh. Yeah, but the Chinese bear got away with it. 30 silver, two, four. for the pair nearest to us. So we look down on the court, which is the Chinese pair now, that they keep the scores close before the change of ends, because both pairs have enjoyed more success from that far side. This is a good little spell Eight, by the Indonesians. Three. three of their previous four matches, they've dropped the second game before coming back, obviously, to win it. And they're going to manage to do it again. Gone long off the back line. Nine, so a six point three. lead now. The Indonesians. Unbelievable. So it's over. That little exchange at the net. Superb by both Pratama oh. and this man, Chang Nan.
Seven five. Interval change. Oh, he tried again. Yeah. Ooh, get the shuttle over the net. So the players change ends. A six point advantage. For the unseeded combination. Oh, that easy. Now they've got to put that out of their minds. Somehow, from this near side of the court, 20 the seconds. 20 seconds. I've got to maintain the attack without hitting long of this far end. Very, very good at going forward. Well, good net six. player, Pratama. Too big a swing from Suwadi. <laughs> no, he's determined to stand his ground, Fu Haifang. Desperately looking for the opportunity to move forward. I couldn't find it. That's long of the back line. 14. Only a seven, seven point advantage now for this new Indonesian combination. And I've never won any title before. Two finals, the Macau Grand Prix gold last year and the Thailand International earlier this year. And we're not that far away from lifting a Super Series title. Oh, simply put away for Pratama. With so not shots from John Nunn. Eight. Oh, got what it deserved. Oh, the Indonesian fans in full voice, fine voice. That's gone long. Oh, this already looks a little Nine. bit nervous to me. Yep, yeah, just loosen that shoulder. Closer to Not. the finishing line.
Oh, oh no, that's definitely my final that goes back. Yeah, from this near side of the courts, the Indonesians just getting a little bit frustrated that they can't get the shovel on the floor. 16. Pair could have won a couple more points then. Really making the Indonesians think and perhaps getting a little bit nervous. That's brilliant. That is brilliant from Jang Nan. This is the first year he's ever played men's doubles at the Singapore Open. Yeah, he's so much better for Hai right. Fung when he's feeding off his opponent's pace. And there was no pace on that little push. This one here. Oh, he struggles with those, the left-hander. Oh, Indonesia's just three points away from the title. Nervous, don't it? Front court player Anga Pratama. Play. Oh, he's got it back. Cool heads. Ricky Karamba Suwadi. And he and Anga Pratama now on the verge 20. of victory. Seven match point opportunities. Late. Super Series for Anga Pratama and Ricky Karanda Suwadi. Well, what a tournament they've oh. had. 21 15, 11 21, 21 14 in the deciding game. Phenomenal. Well, fourth champions this afternoon.
who were appearing in their first ever Super Series tournament final. And all four have walked away with Super Series titles. That is an extraordinary statistic. What about that for a finish in the 2015 OUE Singapore Open? This Super Series event has given us some super stories, but perhaps we saved the best till last. Ricky and Aga, I don't understand this. How have you guys become so good so quickly? You've only been playing together as a pair for, for six months. Bagaimana kamu telah bersama, walaupun baru enam bulan, tapi bagus bersama gitu? Mungkin dari pengalaman saya belajar dari kekalahan sebelumnya saya belajar dari situ dari pengalaman dari pengalaman saya jadi ya mungkin lebih lebih kompak aja sekarang itu so from their experience they have tried to improve and now they are better great stuff guys and no one can say it was lucky you did it the hard way throughout the tournament you beat the number one the number three and the number five seed so that must be extra satisfying Mereka tidak boleh kata yang kamu ini ya laki ya kerana uh, kamu telah dapat uh, melawan mereka yang di first seat, tiga, uh, seat ketiga dan juga seat kelima. Guys, ya kita bersyukur ya kita bisa ngalahin peringkat satu, peringkat tiga dan peringkat lima ya dengan hasil kerja keras kita semoga kedepannya lebih lebih baik. kompak lagi, lebih banyak juara lagi dan buat Indonesia. Indonesia. Ya. Uh, they are actually very thankful that they actually got to uh, fight against the first, the third and the fifth seed and they hope that they can continue to train and also bring uh, you know, glory to Indonesia. Yeah, some fantastic Indonesian support in the crowd. I know that Indonesia has two new badminton superstars, Angela Pratama and Ricky Suwadi. Ladies and gentlemen, the victory ceremony for the OUE Singapore Open 2015 men's doubles. So both pairs step forward for the prize presentation. Can we please invite Mr. Brian Riadi presenting on behalf of the title sponsor OUE Limited. And joining him as well is Mr. Michael Fu, Secretary General of the Singapore Badminton Association. Presenting to you, ladies and gentlemen, the runners up of the OUE Singapore Open 2015 men's doubles, world ranking number 11, Fu Haifer and Tan Na. Well, for a second time this year, the uh, they have had to settle for second best at a super series tournament, Fu Hai Feng and Chang Nan. And the champion of the Open finalists in Birmingham Open at the All England Championships and now the finalists at the OUE World Singapore Open. Anga Pratama and Ricky Karanda Suwane! Our first ever title at international level as a men's doubles competition. It is Anga Pratama and Ricky Suwadi. Thank you very much, Mr. Brian Riadi. And to present, we next we have Mr. Michael Fu to present the Snoopy from MetLife and the prize checks.
taken the photographs. We will also have the presentation for the mixed doubles, of course, the first final of the afternoon, which never happened because Zhang Yang and Zhao Yunlei, the world and Olympic champions, were given a walkover from Liu Kai and Wang Yaxiong. Well, there is confirmation that the World and Olympic champions got the walkover. Uh, apparently, Liu Kai was injured. Of course, Liu Kai last year won the men's doubles with Tai Yun. But uh, when you look down the list of the other winners, Wu Dongni and uh, Zhu Xiaohan, first uh, Super Series tournament final and the first title, and that happened all the way through the afternoon. I think we're actually ready for the prize presentation for the mixed doubles. So we'll come back to wrapping up the results of the day a little later on. Can we please invite Mr. Mahinder Kapoor, Managing Director at Sunlight Sports Private Limited. Together with Mr. Eugene Ang, Treasurer of the Singapore Badminton Association. Runners up for the OUE Singapore Open 2015 Mixed Doubles. Ladies and gentlemen, world ranking number one, Zhang Nan and Zhao Yunlei. Well, our announcer has got it round the wrong way because Zhao Yunlei and Zhang Nan, the world number ones, won the title. And he's just announced them as runners up. Yeah, perhaps he hasn't understood which pair gave the walkover and which pair received the walkover. Yeah, we better just check that. Yeah, yeah. Well, it is Liu Kai and Wang Yashiok. And Wang Yashiok. Mr. Mahinda Kapoor to give them the plus. Well, it is the tall man, Liu Kai, who pulled out. Of course, a year ago, he was on top of the podium. And the, the men's doubles discipline. Wang Yaxiong is not here in the mixed doubles. doubles. World ranking number one, Zhang Nan and Zhao Yunlei. Yes, Zhang Nan and Zhao Yunlei. A 30th, yes, 3-0, 30th Super Series title as a pair. Thank you very much, Mr. Mahinda Kapoor. Next, can we please invite Mr. Eugene Ahn to give away the Medline and the prize checks. The runners up walking away with US eleven thousand four hundred dollars. Well, it was, of course, career titles I was talking about with Zhang Nang and Zhao Yunlei. A 24th Super US Series title for the world and Olympic champions.
what a good men's doubles that was. But the day had really uh, was a disappointing start with the news that the mixed doubles wasn't going to happen. But my goodness me, didn't the other finals make up for it? Four maiden titles for players appearing in their first ever Super Series finals. And that, of course, started with the women's doubles and Yu Dong Ni and Yu Xiao Han beating the world number ones in two straight games. Then uh, Kento Momota uh, beating Hu Yun, coming from 7 12 down in the deciding game. That uh, final lasting an hour and 19 minutes. Uh, then women's singles, well, that was almost as dramatic because Sun Yu had to come back from 17 20 down. She saved three match points before eventually winning 22-20 in that deciding game. And as we just saw in the men's doubles, well, Pratama and Suwadi, well, what a tournament they had, uh, beating Fu Haifang and Chang Nan in today's final in three games, lasting 55 minutes. So some great badminton throughout, uh, but our play of the day comes from the men's singles. wonder it's our play of the day we've had a great week here in Singapore of course the Super Series next event moves on to Australia 26 to the 31st of May hope you'll be able to join us all in Sydney next month but in the meantime from all of us here in Singapore especially from me Jill Clark thanks for your company bye for now